press is trying to kick on, but it's, it's just not, obviously. But as you can see, this is a three-phase system. So there's no capacitor. Um, could have a locked-up uh, compressor or this, you know, I'm trying to say, this contactor could be faulty, so. Let's in the shade, actually. <laughs> Can y'all see this shit? Hopefully you can see it. All right, three phase, two, two eleven, two twelve, two eleven. All right, so we should have the same thing coming through. Two eleven, one twenty, seventy three. All right, so it's just not passing through. Yeah, see, we're going. That's accurate though. So, this contactor's acting a little goofy. Let's go ahead and put this on. Try to get this on lock further. Put this on amps. And then in rush. We'll see what happens. a little funky donkey in there some carbon build up you can see on this leg here um, looks a little wonky I know uh, that one didn't sound so good got some 407 but it sounded rough growling over there yeah got some carbon so um, let me go see if I got a three pole contactor in the Trizuck and we'll go from there maybe when I come back that'll be trying to come on Right now, it just doesn't seem like it's the compressor right now. Because um, there was some sweat on that line. So it did look like at some point it was running. But intermittently, that, that contact is probably dropping in and out. So we should have some. I just stocked up on some good old Packard components. Packard, Titan HD, you know, Titan Max, all those good things. And hopefully we got one. Got it. Let me see that. I'll tell you what, look, I know. Side note, I got this Odelite -like, like turbo. This thing is badass. I don't know if you guys mess with O lights, but these things are really cool. They just had like their anniversary thing, so I'll put some links to their stuff in there. I carry a uh a little 18th anniversary keychain. Purple, whatever. It is what it is. That's uh Bam. 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 Bam, bam. And it did try to start. Uh, let me take a photo of what this looks like only because I can't see. I can't eat and I can't sleep. Always document anyways, right? So 65, which definitely is gonna seem a lot lower. Let me just cross reference this and then we're gonna throw this contactor in. I wanted to take this second to talk to you guys about today's video sponsor, Free to Grow. One, they got really cool hats, a cool logo. Spam the comments if this is a hat you guys would want, and let me see what I can do for y'all. Also, give this number a call right here, man. This is an AI voice answering system that boasts a 75% booking rate. And if you're a business owner, you run a business, service manager, you know a booking rate of 75% is... <sighs> It's freaking amazing. If you're thinking about using AI, which we all know is basically going to be the future of everything, Free to Grow seamlessly integrates with House Call Pro, Service Titan, and of course, Field Pulse, which for a business makes it a no-brainer.
What's really unique about Free to Grow is they personalize a script tailored directly to your business. Also with Free to Grow, it's a flat monthly rate, so you won't be paying overages or any of that bullshit. It stays right within your budget. So you can click the link down below or just give this number a call, set up a demo. I can't wait to hear the calls that come in and let's get on with the video. Now again, we wanna keep these things in the right order since again it is three phase so i'm gonna go ahead and snap a photo of the color coordination and we'll pluck the tops off one by one i'm also going to uh talk to you from the side i'm gonna go shut it off at the thermostat that way we don't have 24 volts running through it real quick all right so let's see first we want to see all right this is so this is the same style. So it's got the spade terminals right on the top here for the 24 volts going on the back. You know, they can go on the side, it doesn't matter. This is just energizing our, our coil inside of this bad busily. Um, and it's got the same spade terminals for the high voltage. So I'm gonna go ahead and disconnect these. I'm gonna wire them up wire for wire. That way, for me, an idiot, it doesn't mess anything up, so. Always check to make sure this is dead. over here right, and then yeah red which is gonna be our common right here for the capacitor just remember that right and we're gonna go ahead and throw on Blackity black. Don't come. Blackity black. Don't come back. And they're going on pretty snug. All right, all right. That's easy peasy. And then, uh, and then this is just straight cool, so it's really not going to matter which side these go on to god that one sounds rough too we gotta get out here and do maintenance on these things all right that's that Do you guys remember without looking at the picture? And I need you now more than ever. I'm gonna actually, you know, I don't know if you can see this kind of oxidized down there. I'm gonna just strip that back real quick. See how bad that looks. If it looks any worse down below, much better. Oh, she wrote. 
looks good. Now, let's go turn it on, see what happens. I don't know what my, my infatuation is with smelling stuff. Anyways, let's go turn it back on, see if this thing turns over. See if it turns over. And we'll know if this thing makes a weird growling noise, whether uh, we got it in phase. Don't hit that. Oh, she running. She running. She running. She, we got cold water. Got it, my friend. So, let me go ahead and check my pressures real quick. The rest of the amps on this bad boy, make sure everything else is kosher. And that's gonna conclude today's video. I hope y'all enjoyed it. I hope you learned something. If you could, smash the like button. Consider subscribing if you're new here. All my subscribers, y'all already know. I appreciate y'all. I'm gonna catch y'all on the next one. Later.